Welcome to Around the Panhandle with TV10, a Hornby Media Group production. I am your host, Colin McLaughlin. We will be taking a look at things to do, places to go, and people to know throughout the Eastern Panhandle. This episode features Tracy Regalia, an Edward Jones financial advisor. Tracy's primary goal is to help individual investors develop an investment strategy geared toward their unique long-term goals. Whether you are planning for retirement, living in retirement, navigating through different life milestones, or just trying to protect the financial future of the loved ones you care for the most, she will work together with you to develop personal strategies to help you achieve your goals. I talked to Ms. Regalia about what financial advisors do and the services they offer. Here are some of the clips from our discussion. I was hired with Edward Jones February 19th of 2019. So that would make it almost two years. So I wasn't born here, but I did go to Martinsburg High School and I went to Shepherd University forever. (laughs) I got two undergraduate degrees and a master's and this is my community. My daughter goes to school here. I've been here for what feels like forever, and I'm happy to work and serve the people, work for and serve the people I I live with in this community. I was in the Air National Guard for 24 years, and 10 of that, I was active duty. Um, While I was there, you know, I was very much involved in the community, doing community service, and that was how I met my Edward Jones financial advisor, (laughs) which I feel like is how it starts for everybody. Uh, And, you know, we became friends and he was my financial advisor and he would always tell me about the Edward Jones opportunity and, you know, what it looked like to be a financial advisor. And he always said that he thought I would be amazing. And um, so it was kind of always in the back of my mind. And I did get my master's in business and, you know, I love a good spreadsheet. (laughs) So... um, I did. I was a resource advisor and you know managed some money uh, in one of my positions at the Air Guard, and I really did enjoy that. But um, you know, I just knew I needed a change because I, there wasn't really a lot of room for growth there. So um, I applied here, and I was hired. <laughs> so, what are some of the uh, services that you offer? So we help people who are planning for retirement, um, who are living in retirement. We help people save uh, for their children's education through 529 plans. Um, Really just any type of financial planning. I mean, I talk to people who really just want to know, should I pay off my house or should I invest my money? So even just offering advice like that. It's just um, nice to be able to help people with, you know, all of their financial issues. Sometimes financial advisors are lucky (laughs) in that when they start, they kind of get a head start. And so they do a program with other financial advisors where they kind of give them some of their clients and, you know, they kind of get that jump start. Well, I didn't have that. And... You know, I used to kind of have some feelings about that, but I met every single person I work with. I met them naturally and face to face, and I have a relationship with every single one of them. I know all of their names. I know everything about them, and they're more, it's more than just a financial advisor client relationship. They all have my cell phone number. (laughs) So it's like they're friends and family, and I love that. My goal is to be a trusted financial advisor in the community, someone who um, is able to go out and do um, volunteer work in the community and meet people naturally and have my clients refer people to me because they know how I've treated them. That's the most important thing. I feel like a lot of times people try to do things on their own, or they're just not even sure what they have. I talk to so many people who they have no idea how they're invested, if their company matches their contribution to their 401k, they don't know if they're going to have enough money to live through retirement. And honestly, that is the most important thing to me is I want to educate people. I want to let them know, you know, what it's going to take for them to be able to live 
through their retirement and into their 90s and not run out of money. That's the number one goal. And I feel like there's no harm for anyone to get a second opinion or a financial analysis and um, just to put things in perspective for them so they know what they're what they need to do and if they need to make any changes they can do that before it's too late. Tracy's office is located at 59 Ruland Road, Suite D in Kearneysville. To learn more visit www.edwardjones.com backslash Tracy dash regalia. To contact Tracy you can call 304-707-0103 or email her at tracy.regalia at edwardjones.com. Her office hours are Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Tuesdays and Thursdays from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. She is also available on weekends but only by scheduled appointments.